There he goes. Their pathing's a little weird sometimes. They get a little confused. Here he goes. Here he goes. First hit. Bam. <laughs> Excellent. All right, guys. We're back with episode number two, Night of the Dead, TVF Gaming here. Really excited to get going to this game. We actually stopped playing and jumped over and played a little bit of multiplayer with our good friends, Otto and True, to kind of figure out some of the mechanics and how things work. So we're going to go in not quite as blind to the first horde, so I'm really excited to do that. We did just have a zombie come in right before I hit record. Uh, he is he was over there somewhere. I guess he already despawned. Uh, but now I kind of understand things a little bit better, so I should be able to move through this one a little better, but we're still going to struggle because I'm still not 100% on some of the mechanics of the game, and we're just still really early on. I will say that we feel really weak in terms of like these other zombies and stuff like that. I feel like we're fairly weak as a character, so we're going to have to really get into some stuff to figure out how to get stronger. Uh, the research table looks like where it's at for that. I, stro I scrolled down in that, and you can see all the different skills and stuff on here, which is really cool. Uh, the Nova's Boxer. Uh, we have the stuff to do that if we wanted to. But Boxer, Boxer, Pro Boxer. We probably want to do these ones here for gathering and stuff like that. I assume that's a little more important, but I'm really not sure. I don't know. Let me see. Where is like the... Is there one for archery or something like that? Oh, here we go. Combatant. Martial Artist, Ranger, that's probably it right there. Now it's Moving Speed, Tactician Strength, Medic. I don't know if Archery has its own little tier here. I'll have to kind of look through it see if I can find it. But I'm really excited to get further into this. If you guys enjoyed the episode today, if you guys enjoyed it today, hit the like button. Thank you so much for the support on the last video. It actually did really well. Really surprised with that. Uh, it's, it's a fairly new game, kind of fun. Anyways, hey, we're wasting a lot of time. It's already 1600. We need to get into some things here. I think we need to build... One of our first traps. It, need, it wants us to build a pendulum. All right, and I don't really know how to do that. So let's see if we can start figuring that out here. Uh, our inventory is an absolute mess, of course, and I don't think I can build a storage box just yet. But we'll look in that in just a second. So what do we need to make this pendulum? So we're gonna go into here, and this little one down here, and melee pendulum. Oh, it's a little expensive. All right, we need lumber. What is this? Wooden plank, lumber, nail, and rope. All right, uh, is it this one? All right, it is not that one. We can make a lot of a lot of things in here, though. Really excited about that. That's cool. Is it this one? Okay, here's our wooden planks and our lumber. Okay, one, two, three, four. And then I'm going to need some more to do the next one. This is, oh, here's where we make our rope. One, let's make some cloth. And then let's make a bunch of rope again. Okay, now, how close are we now? Let's check it again. And we can hopefully get this pendulum up, and then we'll kind of figure out what we got to do next. Uh, let's see. Special, no, no, sorry. Melee, pendulum. All right, I just need four lumber and three nails. Can I make nails? I don't know how to make nails. Uh, maybe it's something we can make later. For right now, can't make it there. And can't make it there. We can make it here. Okay, nails. One, two, three, four. All right, okay, we just need a little bit of lumber, and I think we're good to go, guys. We can do this. All right, let's get into some stuff. Uh, I think we're going to build separate from our little spot here because I don't want this to all get broken, so we'll build some foundations as well. So let's do that. So we'll get some foundation going. I'll get some iron going. We'll get some ropes going, and then hopefully get into our first horde tonight. I'm really excited about it. It's going to be a lot of fun. Uh, the mechanics of it are very cool. So early thoughts on this game. The game has a lot of promise. It's got some issues. It's definitely early on in the development. Uh, and it's a very, very small studio, so it does have some issues, but I think Horde Knight, it kind of shines with some of the stuff that it can do, so we'll definitely get into that. All right, let's do this. Should just need a couple more of these. All right, I'm hearing the animals. Please don't come get me. There we go. All right. Let's build... Oh, Oh, it's just a fox. Okay, it looked like something was on fire. I was so scared for a second. All right, can I build like a couple foundations right over here? There you go. So we'll go like this. Build, floor, foundation. Let's lower it just a little bit. Rotate it a bit. And we're going to go like that. Got it? One, two, three. And if I remember right, the pendulum is like four wide, I think. Okay, we're going to need a little bit more. Let's get some more. Just keep chopping down trees. We also need to make a storage box so we don't have everything on our inventory. It looks like dying is not too big of a deal. Uh, we died quite a few times. It does lower your health, your stamina, and whatever the other bars up there on the top left. So that does definitely change. 
So we'll have to keep an eye on that. Let's see, there we go. Okay. Not, and the targeting is a little weird, but we're getting a little more used to it. And it works way better on single player. We did play on a server. The server definitely has a little bit of issue. I think it's really early on for there, so they need some definite optimization for that to really work well. Uh, but it was a lot of fun. And I haven't tried co-op where you invite someone into your game. Maybe that works a little bit smoother. We could definitely get into that. Uh, let's see. We need like this. Stare. Like that. Build. Okay. Rotate it and lower it. Bam. Okay, now what do we need? I think we need a few of those lumber pieces in order to make the pendulum, right? Let's go melee, pendulum, just need four lumber. So let's knock down a couple more trees just to be safe. And then we'll make this pendulum, and then we'll figure out how we can build out the horde base from there. And we should be good to go for the first horde. It, from what the comments said in the last video, it's not too hard. I don't know if it changes based on if you're on multiplayer or single player. There was quite a few zombies when there was the three of us playing, so I'm a little worried that we're not going to be able to handle it, but we're just going to have to see. All right, let's finish this up. This should give us enough to go back and do it. Uh, but I really like the crafting system. I, I just really like... I'm enjoying this game in general. Uh, it's just got some really cool stuff to it. And it's way smooth in, in single player. I'm enjoying it a lot. Uh, let's see. Craft this one. And I've already forgot which one I need. Hold on. We need... Melee. Pendulum. Four of the lumber. Okay, lumber. And there is a little thing down here where you can change how many you're crafting at once for right now we're, we're good with what we got all right so let's go make this pendulum all right and it looks like no, your actions don't really make any of your stuff decrease or increase at all the food is all you really need to really increase to where you have full health and stuff like that again which is nice and there's no hunger drain or anything which is really good uh, I mean, I'm sure that stuff's going to be added later on but for right now it's not something you have to worry about especially early on while we're learning the game it's kind of a big deal Okay, we're going to go that way with it. Got it. Oh, my God, we got a trap. Look at that. Now, these early missions are huge important because you just noticed we just got Molotov cocktails from as the reward for that. All right, next one is a compressor. So I guess we need another foundation. Let's go floor, foundation. We need some more vines. Let's go get some more vines. So let me work just for a minute on getting some more stuff chopped down. I'll be right back. <laughs> Okay, here we go. Foundation again. Let's build at least a couple more of these. One. Two. And three. Four. I really didn't want to build that first one. I don't know why I did that. I was wanting to go one more back, but that's okay. All right. So look, what would we need for the compressor? All right. Melee and compressor. So the hard part here looks like it's the trap machine. I need to figure out how to make the trap machine. Then we need planks, lumber, iron ingot, nail, and rope. So the hardest part is whatever this trap machine is. Uh, it is made at the crafting table. So let's go back over here. It's already 1,800. Starting to stress a little for time, but I think we're okay. We could definitely do some looting hopefully tomorrow, and we'll probably just stay here. In the multiplayer, we went ahead and moved to the city. And what I might do is I did record just our Horde Nights, and at the end of these episodes, maybe I'll include just the Horde Night, because you know it's always a lot of fun when Otto, Teru, and myself kind of get together and do some crazy stuff. So I'll show you some of our Horde Nights maybe. I'll kind of include that in these videos. I think that'd be a good idea. Uh, let's see. We definitely need some rope again, but we need cloth again. All right, we're going to work on that. Okay, which which one is it? Is it this one? All right, I don't see it there. Don't see it there. Hold on, let me look at this again. It said crafting table, right? Is it this one? Gear, okay, trap machine. So it's not unlocked. We need research engineer. So we might have to finally spend some of our engineer points. So let's do this, research, engineer. We need to do trap machine. Okay. So we'll have to research this, and then trap machine. Bam, okay, that's huge. So that allows us to make that. Let's go ahead and look into this now. So which bench is it on? I literally just forgot. All right, this one over here. So now trap machine, I need plastic and gear. I can make a gear. Oh, my inventory is full. Oh my God, it happened, okay. Uh, it finally happened that our inventory is full. Let's see, equipment, no. Utility, storage box. Four nails, one plastic, and one plank. 
Okay, four nails. Okay, struggle to find the right one. Four nails. Okay. Oh, that's right. We just literally just went through this. Um, hmm. I guess we could eat something. I'm just afraid to eat anything. All right, a little bit of apple action. Okay, now can I make it? Okay, now we go gear. Do we already make no gear? And then plastic I'll make in just a second. What else can we get rid of here? Let's just drop the mushroom for now. There we go, plastic. Nail. Nope, drop that. Craft the nail. Okay, how about now? What else do we need? Okay, utility. Storage box. All right, I need one wooden plank, then we can make it. Perfect. One wooden plank. And then, if I remember correctly, these things are really small, which is kind of a bummer, but it'll work for right now. And we can't place it anywhere. There we go. Okay. All right, now, let's store as much as we can. Looks like food and stuff like that does not spoil. You can right click to move it fast, which is awesome. Let's get all the stuff that you can't really craft. These are huge right here, the power bars. They refill quite a bit of your overall stats, so definitely keep those. All right, save them as long as you can. Okay, I think we're pretty good. Bullets we don't really have a use for just yet. Oh, sneakers, let's put some new sneakers on. Do these give you any new effects? No. But they look, they look pretty good though, look at that. Bam, look at us, man, looking good. And then we'll store those two since we don't really have a use for them now. In fact, I think we can break them down too. I don't know if we get any good materials out of it. Should we try? No, we'll do that later. We'll do that later. Focus on the most important things right now. All right, now, let's look into this trap machine again. Okay, over here. Oh, I just picked stuff up. My bad. Okay. Okay, try again. Okay, trap machine. I need one plastic. Craft it. And now trap machine, craft. Awesome. Okay, we're going to get into this compressor. Let's see, melee, compressor, two lumber, four plank, and then nails. Two lumber, and then a bunch of planks. All right, we're running a little bit out of time. We're okay, though. I think, the, if I remember right, the horde doesn't start until 2400, and it only lasts for two hours. So this video will go all the way through the horde, and then first thing into the morning. It does get a little bit dark at night, so I may up the gamma. In fact, oh, I think I already did. Hold on. Options, graphic. Yeah, we did up the gamma a little bit already, but we're going to leave it like that just so you guys can hopefully see better. It might give you a little bit of a washed out look, and I'm really sorry for that, guys, but it, otherwise it's just too dark. Uh, let's see here. Uh, what we were, oh, my bad. Completely forgot what we're working on here. We definitely need some plastic and stuff, too. We might have to run into town just a little. But I, I would love to have this compressor on there. Once we get the compressor... I feel like we'll be pretty safe. Okay. All right. Let's go back. We're going to run just into the, the very, very first part of town. And see if we can get this. Uh, how close are we? We need... So it's mainly just the stuff for the ropes. So we really need like the little boxes that are usually in the center of the road. Let's make sure we're ready. All right, and I don't think, we haven't cleared out any houses or anything, have we? So we gotta be really skittish. Oh, we did, we did, we went in there. So just be really careful. All right, using a knife on the car, just like I do in real life to open cars. Piece of iron, research material. I was hoping for some of those little boxes. There's a bunch of those little boxes you can usually find. Copper wire. And now, I was reading about this, and apparently there is going to be like a storyline with this. And I'm really excited to kind of see what they do with that. I think that'll be a lot of fun. Piece of cloth, perfect. There we go. Some iron. This should give me the other stuff I need. There we go. Piece of cloth, nice. Alright, let's go back and see how close we are. I don't want to go too far away. Get these ones. Alright. Try 
kind of keep an eye out while we do this. It's a little nerve wracking. All right, 1900. Just keep an eye on that clock. And I haven't really figured out how exactly the the time is compared to real time. Oh god. Oh god. No. 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 Oh, it's still chasing. Oh god. I hope the trap works on dogs. Please work on dogs. It does not work on dogs. Dang. What am I supposed to do against this thing, man? Okay. Okay. Oh. Okay. Oh, I got him. We got him. Oh, okay. Awesome. I guess we're eating good. Not sure I would want to eat stuff like that, but that's all right. <laughs> got to do what you got to do in the end of the world. All right. Uh, let's see. Let's go back and meet the, make the stuff. Got all of our arrows back. And let's see. We need compressor. Four planks. And then we need the nails. So planks times four. And then we need the nails. I think we needed three of those. And then I need lots of rope. I don't think I'm going to have enough rope. Let's see how close we are. Like this. Melee. Compressor. Five more rope, two more nails. Okay. All right. Rope is going to be the hard part. Uh, I have two more of that, but I only have one more of the vine. And there's no other way to make it, right? Because cloth, you need piece of cloth. So I don't think we're going to get this made up before the horde starts. I don't think so. All right. Uh, there is another trap we can make. But let's let's just keep working. We'll see if we can get lucky here. There you go. In fact, I think there was a couple cars the other way. Maybe we should look over there real quick. I don't know if I already searched them or not. It is getting very, very foggy. We do have a light, so we'll turn the light on as it gets a little darker. I guess we'll leave it on now, even though it makes it even more scary and eerie. Yeah, but this game is pretty. It is a pretty huge improvement over... Seven days when it comes to just the looks of it. The Seven Days has had years to work on a lot of their stuff, so that's why you know it's a little more of a refined game, even though it's not a greatly refined game. <laughs> All right, let's break this stuff. All right, we'll work on a few of the smaller things while we're going to get some more paper, hopefully. I mean, not more paper, cloth. Okay, back up here now. Uh, I'll have that last part all in like fast forward so you can kind of see what was going on there. All right, let's make some more cloth. Let's make some more rope. All right, please tell me we're close. Come on. Okay, B button, melee. I can make oh, I can make a cutter. Oh man, we might just do the cutter instead. All right, guys, we're going with the cutter. Uh, I I want to do the compressor just for the mission. But I'm one rope short, and I just don't think I can get the last stuff for it. So, yeah, let's do it. We're going to make the cutter, and then I need a wall or two, and then we're good to go. And then we're ready for the horde. Then we're kind of hang out, wait for the horde to come in. And hopefully, it's going to go halfway okay. It's, it's a super small little makeshift base. Uh, I could use a wall or two maybe. Oh, come here. Oh, that's too slow. I should have used an arrow, but it's fine. All right, so let's do this cutter, right? So we're going to go like this, and... Melee, cutter, build, bam. Okay. And then I need to work on a couple walls. What do I need for walls? Oh my god, I need ropes. But it's okay, I only need a couple. I need plank and lumber. Alright. And then I should have lots of these little tree branches, hopefully, because that's what you need to repair these things. We do, alright. So plank, lumber. Let's cut down a couple trees real quick. And then we'll use those. This game is all about looking up to that top right to see what the time is at right there. It's definitely, definitely interesting. All right. 
get that and it looks like none of the weapons i think we mentioned this in the first video but none of them really have durability or anything so we haven't had to really worry about that which is good okay get all those all right at least one more of these there we go all right let's go ahead and make enough stuff for the wall Wooden plank times four, lumber times four. And does that give me enough for walls? What else would we need? Walls, I can make one, two walls, and that is it. So we need a little bit more. Let's chop down another one. And then I think we're just gonna camp out until it's time. I might go ahead and refill our health just for the horde too. Also, I'm really curious what this b door is over here that we came out of. There we go. Got it. All these. Nice. Okay. All right. Now, let's see. We need... I already forgot. Go with walls. And I might make one window. So, let's do one window. I need... A couple more of the planks. Wooden plank. And another lumber. And one more plank. Alright, I think we're good. I'll, I did want to see these vines that we're getting. That doesn't work for cloth or anything, does it? Rope. Oh, the vines is the other, the other side of it. Okay. And now we have enough to make it. We could have made that one more rope. Dang, I didn't realize that. That's okay. We're still going to need ropes later. We'll make those. Uh, I'm sure we'll need a couple nails, and we might make a couple more arrows before we get started here. So let's go put these walls up. This is just to give us a little bit of extra defense. I would definitely like, if we had a little more time to get a couple more things up, I might try to make a couple of these little barricades. There's these little melee barbed fence, and it doesn't take too much other than wood and a little bit of rope, so that's not too bad at all. All right. So if we go like this and wall... Okay, I can put it there. Nice. So let's go. In fact, I don't want to do that. I want to do the the window. Okay. I'm hoping that it can turn just fine with it. I'm super worried that this wall is going to stop it from turning. Hopefully that doesn't happen. Okay. And then we're going to go with a wall. Maybe we shouldn't do wall. We should do a door. For that, I need one more nail. Hmm. We'll do that. Okay. Let's go with a door. I just need a nail. And it will make a door so we can go through it. Because we might have to go back and forth through it in order to lure the zombies through that little trap. Alright. Let's go like this. No, not sorry. Wrong one. This one. Nail. There we go. We can make a door. A lot of back and forth. I should have built these a lot closer. but And eventually I'll have all this in one spot. I'll put it all into one big base. And we're going to try to do this a few episodes. I'm not sure how far we'll go with it. Uh, it's definitely, the, the last one got good enough views where it can definitely come back for another episode. Because I was really surprised about how many views it did. Thank you for that. Let's go floor, wall, door. There we go. Nailed it. Okay. Or should we just go here with it? There we go. Okay, and then hopefully, hopefully that'll be good. Now there are some zombies that can jump, so it does make sense to get yourself some better stuff than this. This is not the best setup. Wall, in fact, we're going to do another window here. I mean, it doesn't really make sense because we can't do that all the way around. Can we do, is there like a fence? Here we go. Can do like these on the side just to, so no thing jumps up here. Hopefully. Okay, all the way on the edge. Okay, that should work. <laughs> this is the worst horde base ever. All right, uh, the, the biggest thing is to keep in mind with this game, it's not like Seven Days to Die where you build like a big built up horde base. It's uh, Otto kept describing it as like tower defense, and I don't know anything about tower defense, so I'm going to agree with him. Uh, but it's definitely. 
it's all about taking advantage of the zombies pathing and AI. And I mean, that would be the same even if it was a real apocalypse, I guess, because you would kind of understand how they work. You'd study them to figure out how they work and then you would set up defenses based on that. So I think it makes sense. All right, let's go. Let's get this energy bar real quick because I want to refill our food up. So let's go like this. We're going to eat just one of them. You see that fills up everything up there, which is awesome. And then we're going to throw that back over there and anything else that I can throw. If anything else stacks. Nothing might stack because we're not like that lucky. Okay. And then what would I need for a second box? Nails in plastic. We might be able to do it. Hold on. Five nails. And plastic. Okay, and then we can go utility, storage box, build. Okay. Can we stack boxes? Doesn't look like it. Can I put them on the ground? I can. Okay. Alright, then we'll store stuff in here. Alright, go like that. Bones. Pretty much all this stuff that's not ready to use stuff uh, iron and stuff I'll keep planks I'll keep oil can go all right research material definitely stay okay all right that's at least as much as I can do all right uh, let's hang out it's it's two hours until the horde time I might chop down some more trees and just do a little bit of more of the what is it the these little spike traps we might try to do a couple of these if I can uh, I would need more rope. I guess maybe not. We'll, we'll figure it out. I'm going to kind of figure out what else I can do. I don't think there's much else I can do. It's Now it's just kind of a, a matter of hanging out until it all starts. So, All right. I'll see you guys in a few minutes for the horde. All right. I haven't tried using these yet. I'm going to waste one right now just because I want to try it when it's still daylight. Or not daylight, but not horde time yet. Let me see. It's not left click. Ah, okay. I don't even think we need to test it. Hold right and then left click. I think. All right, we're almost there. It's almost horde time. Uh, so this is all we got done for the horde time. It's not a lot. Hopefully, we, we'll be all right. This will swing down and punch him in the face. This will Ginsu him up, and we love this. I want to use about 20 of these things right here. I think they're pretty amazing. So we're going to definitely try those really soon. We've got one door to protect us, which is not a lot, but I think we'll be okay. And you can, I think you can upgrade it. Not upgrade it, but repair it while they attack it. So if they make it that far, I probably should put an... I probably should have put the door here, but for some reason I was kind of concerned it would get in the way. I don't really know why. Uh, but we'll figure all that out. We'll kind of figure it out as we go here. Let's get that closed. And then first thing in the morning, we'll go ahead and start taking out some of these buildings over here. Do some other stuff uh, before the you know next day really gets started because you have quite a bit of time. The horde goes from 12 to 2 at least these first couple days. And I don't know if it changes after that, but 12 to 2. So it's a really short horde, but it gets more and more intense as you go. Hopefully we can survive it okay. And then 2 a.m. to like 5, 6, 7 a.m. It's pretty dark, kind of like it would be in real life. It's still pretty dark, so we'll kind of have to see, you know, how much visibility we have going into houses. should be nice and scary. And you start seeing different zombies and stuff like that, too, that have, you know, different durability or different powers or different skills. I don't know what you would call it, but different abilities uh, that make them a little more difficult to fight. So we'll, we'll see how it works. I'm, I'm a little nervous. Like I said, I'm really nervous about this thing here just because it's, like, touching. I'm hoping that that's not a mechanic that's going to mess us up. <laughs> we'll see. We'll see. We had ours on like a corner, so it wasn't too big of a deal. What we'll do in the future is I will build kind of like this big S shape or like windy platform thing, and we'll keep going around. It'll be like this giant, you know, death trap maze, kind of an, a, an American Ninja Warrior maze of zombie killing. So that's kind of what we're looking for. All right, uh, I'm going to wait out for the horde. As soon as it starts, we'll start back at the video. Let's do this. Oh, wave has started. Okay, I almost didn't see it. I heard the music. All right. Let's see where they come from and how this works. Uh, I don't know if there's like some predefined thing to how how they decide where they spawn from. Might take us a minute here. What if they're not spawning at the other base? That would be really sad. I, I assume it's not based on like your spawn point, right? Okay. The music's a little intense. Okay. I'm not really sure, guys. Uh, let's see. I'm good with it. I'm good with a nice chill horde if that's what happens.
All right. Look at that. They know we're too advanced. They're not even coming. They're not all the way back there, are they? Oh, I see one. Hold on. I at least see one. There he is. There he is. There you go. Come on around, buddy. There you go. Come right through here. Where are you going? There he goes. Their path thing's a little weird sometimes. They get a little confused. Here he goes. Here it goes. First hit. Bam. <laughs> Excellent. All right. And then you can reload it with R. Bam. Reloaded. Bam, bam. Excellent. This is kind of where the game sets itself apart from some of the other games I've played. That right there. Now, the horde will increase here in a minute. Or at least we'll get at least one big wave. Or maybe that was because we had three players. I don't know. Okay, here we go. A little intense. No, no, go over there, buddy. There you go. A little confused. Okay. Okay. There they go. Here, do your thing. That is freaking insane. <laughs> Changed your mind. Like, alright, that's not worth it. Oh my god. That was brutal. So they all came from that way this time. Alright. Yep, a hero buddy climbing over there. So the Ginsu hasn't even had to turn on yet. I like it. Uh, now, it, if I would have planned this out a little better, I would put the Ginsu up front just because I think it does some crazy damage. Okay. Don't know where you're going, buddy. Baby, come back. There you go. There you go. Come on. I'm just up here just hanging out waiting for you. There you go. <laughs> Insane. All right, there's a couple out here. There you go. Take that. Take that. Oh, they do a good job with that right there. Look at that leg just hanging out. Or is that an arm? It's an arm. My bad. TVF doesn't know the difference between arms and legs. All right. In my defense, usually I'm the one getting beat up, so. Get it. <laughs> Yeah, so I guess uh, with single player in this pendulum, you're kind of good to go, Horde Knight, number one. Oh, there we go. There's a couple coming. All right. We shouldn't have to fire a weapon if this goes well. Come on in. Goodbye. Oh. All right. That's pretty good. We're not even one hour in, though. Can I shoot just an arrow just to make myself feel like we're contributing? No. Oh, all your body parts left. There you go. There's a big one. Make sure we keep this repaired. There you go. One hour in. One hour in. So far, so good. Alright, man, I really want to see a bunch of them come up at once. Let's see what happens. We're just kind of like a spectator on this one. I like it. Oh. Why do I hear... You coming, dude? Oh, brutal. Alright, this guy's making me a little nervous. He's down there beating on stuff. Okay. All right, there's a bunch of them coming now. Okay, repair. Reload. All 
Yeah, I don't know what he's hitting on. Let's go find out. Okay, now you're going to move? There you go. There you go. A little bit different view for us. Nice. All right. Everything's going fine. There we go. Now we got the group coming. Here we go. I mean, it's probably getting close to the end. Here we go. All right, let's see if they make it through the pendulum finally. Oh, nope. Awesome. Okay. The pendulum is a beast. Okay, should we go through one more time? Let's do it. Go ahead. Let's see what you guys got. Okay. Reload this guy. Okay, the music kind of chilled out. I still hear footsteps, though. There they are. All right, the music quit, but we've got a couple stragglers. Let's see it. Come on. Man, the Ginsu's coming out of this clean, man. Didn't get hit once. There it goes. I kind of got to spin for a second. All right, let's go ahead and pick up the loot. We got ourselves some research material and a piece of cloth. Nice. Oh, man, not too bad, guys. Not too bad. What do you guys think? First horde. So a uh, quick question for you guys. If you guys made it through this this video this far, would you guys rather see a longer video so it's day two in its entirety? So it goes all the way from day two, all the gathering and looting and building, all the way through the horde night? Or do you like it where it's separate between horde night and the day? Uh, because it just depends. Uh, in terms of time-wise, the video gets a little long. Like this was a 45-minute video just recording from 1600 to now. So I think it's a 90-minute video. That'd probably be a little too long, but I could cut things out. I don't know. I'm kind of I'm gonna have to figure out how we should do that in terms of just to make the video flow better. But hope you guys enjoyed it. Like, comment, subscribe. See you guys in the next one. Night of the Dead at TBF Gaming. Thank you for the support. See you in the next video. I'm gonna work. Is she gonna go all the way around? She might. I don't know. True story. Started shooting her. I'm letting her go to see where she goes. Right. Is she attacking the foundation? Practice. I'm not sure. If you aggro them, they probably will. Okay. She's attacking something. Yeah, no, they're attacking even if you don't attack them. This guy's confused. All right, well, let me uh, let me lead her through the thing. Hey, hey lady. Come here. <laughs> I like that you guys oh are jumping God, down. It's I hit awesome. The spikes. Oh, so did the okay zombie did too. Oh, zombie chasing you, true. Watch uh -oh. out. Coming. See if you can make it to where other ones. Oh! Spikes bad. <laughs> spikes bad. Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. Oh! <laughs> That's really amazing. Bad. Really bad. That was awesome. Not recommended. It's too funny. So if we stand right behind the spikes, they won't come up the spikes? No. They definitely followed you when you went that way. Yeah, they did. Oh, I gotta reload it. R. I reloaded it. Oh, you it. did have to reload it. Okay. Watch out, Otto. Nice. Good job. <laughs> that was perfect. Dodge and weave. All right, so then okay. Uh, reload. Wait, wait, okay, wait. did they turn back around? Reloaded. Uh, they're coming oh, careful, to the Otto. door. Yeah. Autos. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Otto. <laughs> Watch out, Otto's about to come. Oh, God. Nice. <laughs> that's awesome. Got one of them. He's got okay, that's really too. cool. <laughs> Go ahead. I dare you to, to play Duck Duck Goose. I think Goose he's coming. The giant ball of death. He, oh, nope, he's not coming. No? Okay, maybe that might be my fault. Looks like he came to me. Uh. Oh, God. Oh, there he goes. He's going. Let he him go. Me. You're behind me, and I heard a noise. No, just, yeah, just me, just me. Okay, there they come. Yep, yep they're, they're coming. Whap! Boom! Nice. Oh, it chopped him in half. Oh, okay. How do you reload it? Uh, okay, just, hold R. You need a stick and hold R. Yep, got it. Got it. All right, that's pretty cool. She's getting the arrow. She's a unicorn. She's a Okay, so we definitely have to make it to where they fought. Like, if you stay over here, she'll follow the path. Yeah, Otto, come over here. Come over here. Come right here in the middle. When we were all right here, she followed it. If 
not, I'll go lead her in again. No, they're coming. Yeah, that guy's coming. He's getting hit yeah, by we're the hitting spike. The spike yeah. The... yeah. Oh yeah, they are smacking into the spikes hard. Hmm. Hey, they're hitting him a bunch out there. Wish I could see. There's a couple of them. They're hanging out like underneath us. Yeah. Oh, there's a lot. Oh, yep. There he is. Lead him. Lead him. Mhm. Mm oh, I fell off too early. Okay. Come on up, come on up, come on, come on. Bam! Okay. Reset it. Uh, I got it, I got it. It's reloaded. You going up? Okay, go. Look out, look out! Jump! I can't close the door. Uh. It won't let me close. It won't let me close. Uh oh. Okay. Yeah, I couldn't get it. Hmm. They're coming after auto. They like auto. They go. They come out. Oh, they they, they, they turn around. They turn. You gotta kind of like hang out in the middle till the thing goes off. <laughs> oh no! They're on the door. Okay. Door's at ninety nine percent. It's fine. I can't get up. There you go. Oh, auto's coming too. My bad. Come on, guys. Come on, come on. Yep. There you go. Oh, nice. auto. Oh, no. <laughs> oh, no. Auto. 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 Oh, no. <laughs> Don't reload it yet. Okay. All right. Reloaded. It's reloaded. <laughs> they all died. That was great. <laughs> oh, there's a couple underneath us. Oh, there's a bunch. They're coming like crazy. Oh no, no, I'm stuck in can't do anything mode again. Oh, the, he helped me. He saved me. Good job, zombie. Buddy, come say hi. <laughs> Bam! Perfect, perfect. I'm in the right spot. Oh god, reload it. Hang on, hang on. Reloading. Nice, he's down, he's down. Reloaded. Yeah, if, hey, Otto, you can duck right here. If you come to the side, I'm up here ducking. <laughs> You're turducking? Oh god, I'm yeah, yeah. ducking the foundation. Oh no. I'm ducking the turducken. Bam! Bam! Oh god, he made it through! <laughs> okay, but then he got smashed. <laughs> I reloaded it. Oh, do you need help or are you good? Depends. Oh, you got so many. I'm coming. Behind you, behind you, behind you. Yep. Nice. Yeah, yep. Yeah. Oh. Oh, there's whoa, a bunch lag. of friends. Whoa. Come on up, come on up. Whoa. Yeah, that was weird lag. That was a bad time for lag. Alright, I'm guiding them up again. Come on. No, I missed. Get him, Otto. Get him. <laughs> That's so worth it. <laughs>